Okay, here we are with Noah. Noah at the farm downtown. How do you, how do you, how is it properly labeled? The farm downtown. The farm downtown, yeah. Beverly. What's the address? 350 Rantoul Street, Beverly, Mass. 350, and you've been killing it. You've only been open for two weeks. Yeah, just about two weeks. And you've been killing it. You told me like you got like you got policemen coming in here. You got college for students reason, coming in right? here for the good reasons. But like great lunch crowds. Yeah, it's um it's interesting. We learned a lot from our last restaurant experience. Obviously, the Farm Bar and Girl in Essex. So open up this location when we did it. We, uh, we didn't do any advertising again. We wanted word of mouth to travel, so if we succeed in word of mouth, we'll travel, and our place will get busier and busier. But again, we got some great press on us prior to opening, and word traveled before we even opened. We had 500 Facebook fans before we even opened the doors. So word traveled quick. So the minute we opened the doors, there's a line out there, literally a line out the door. Police came for crowd control, because that's how busy it was. <laughs> And uh, so we did that for about, uh, so it's been slammed for about the last two weeks and you know, we're hitting our groove and you know, we're happy. Okay, now, what are the diff key differences between the Farm Brown Grill in Essex and this place here in Beverly? Yeah, they're um, very similar in, in terms of kind of the ambiance and the feel and what we try to, and what we try to portray here. But the Farm Bar and Grill obviously has seats to 300 people. It's enormous, volleyball court, horseshoe pits, live music, and so forth, which we're actually advertised here. Uh, so that's, that's that business. Here is an offshoot of that, and what it is is it's focused on quick service, but completely fresh. Everything here is homemade from scratch. There's nothing frozen at all. So we keep to our most popular menu items, and we brought in items into Beverly that you really can't find. You know, especially when you need to lunch for five, ten minutes quick in and out. Yeah. So, for example, we have, and we'll go over the menu, but we brought some of our, our top, we brought our top burgers from the Farm Bar and Grill, which North Shore Magazine gave us best burgers in North Shore. So we brought those here. Uh, we brought our fish tacos, brought a number of menu items. So the, the main difference you could say is that obviously there's no liquor license here, but this focus is quick service, very inexpensive, um, but all fresh, all made from scratch. So the same concept. There's a lot of business. Quality. There's a lot of businesses around here. So I imagine like that five minutes in, get great fresh food and out. I mean that must be that must be a big part of the success. Yeah, that, that's the key, and that's the focus, and that's kind of the trend, obviously, as you see going on in the restaurant industry is fast, fresh, yeah. so that you and, can and, and reasonably priced. I mean, I, I, was looking at, I was looking at the prices. I mean, it's you can get a half pound, fresh, never frozen Angus burger, hand packed for six bucks. I'm looking at your menu. Is there anything over ten dollars on that? Uh, nothing. Absolutely nothing. You can get fish tacos for seven bucks. That's crazy. So it, the prices are seven dollars and under. It must be slammed. Yeah, it's going great. People are shocked at how we can keep prices so low. But the thing is, is that we do everything fresh. We do our own grocery shopping. We keep it as a family-run business. So we want to provide the best value. All right, and awesome. you were telling me earlier we should bring this up, point up too, because I think this is key. Yeah. You're open till what time at night? Till okay, so on Sunday nights we close at 9 p.m. Open up 11 to 9 on Sundays. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday we're open from 11 to 11, and Thursday, Friday, and Saturday we're open till 2 a.m. 2 a.m. Yeah. So, oh my God, talk about mu perfect munchy food. Yeah. Perfect like. Well, there's bars all along the street, so there's no reason for us to get a liquor license. Yeah. You know, our focus is food, fresh quality food. Uh, that you can get quick, five, ten minutes. You can either sit down here and enjoy the ambiance, the music, and the, and the atmosphere, or you can take it to go. But either way, you're in and out. You know, so you, where, can, oh, you go, you go out for a night. You're starving. You want to fill up your stomach and to, so you go to sleep nice and full without having a, just booze in your, right. in your system. Get a nice pulled pork. Can you get pulled pork sandwiches? Yeah, pulled pork. Obviously, you can get a junior and a super. One difference from the farm is that you can get a junior, um, you can get a junior pulled pork sandwich or a super. You can get a junior burger or a super burger. Wow. So we're keeping it economical. So if you want just a quick quarter pound Angus burger, never frozen hand packed, you can come in and out five minutes and you're good to go, you're on your lunch. Fantastic. And the problem is now, as you know, is that there's not many places you can get a quick lunch that's completely fresh. You have to go to pizza shops, you know, typically, right. which everything's frozen. Yeah, you know, I mean, you can only do that so itself. much and you really exactly. feel disgusted with yourself. Exactly, so we have you a few salads here, we have, um, uh, the majority of everything that we have at the farm in Essex, except more uh, inexpensive, relatively speaking. Yeah. Today. All right. Let's go. Let's go over the menu. Let's go up here. We'll, we'll pan in. Why don't you point? 
Let's see what we got here. How you guys doing? So why don't you point out some of the more popular uh, items up on the menu? Yeah, um, again, the entire menu is is awesome. Everyone has their own favorite. Like the fish tacos sell out all the time. Like we People buy those every single day. Because you get a fresh piece of haddock wrapped in a flour tortilla with lettuce, salsa, guacamole, homemade guacamole. So those have been a big seller. $6.95 for that. $6.95 for three huge tacos. Yeah. That's ridiculous, isn't it? The, um, obviously the pulled pork is the most popular item because you can't really find pulled pork or really good pulled pork around. Real, that's real stuff because you guys... That's homemade smoked for yeah. five hours with our homemade barbecue sauce on top. And you can load... The other thing about this place is you can load it with every, whatever you want. You can get bacon, jalapenos, you can put on the roast Ooh. beefs or the pulled smoked chicken sandwiches or burgers, pulled pork, whatever you'd like. We got soups and salads. We still have our huge salads. Um, everything fresh again. So the farm salads is in the seasonal are a couple of people's favorites. We still have our mozzarella bites. We brought them over here, which are very popular. Um, we have a bunch of wraps as well. And I see you cross promote too, because up on the board over here, you got uh, you have like your daily at the Farm Bar and Grill Essex. Your, uh, your schedule for all of your different stuff. Because yeah, because obviously as we know, you know, the, the Farm Bar and Girl in Essex, that's kind of, that's always been our focus and that's where we started. But it's huge, it's got over, you know, 90 menu items, yep. volleyball court, it's a whole complete complex where this is just, you know, offshoot of that where you can come in and out and get fresh quality food in five minutes. So we want people to know that, hey, if you have time to go sit down and have a dinner, definitely come to the farm and you can actually bring your receipt from here and you receive 20% off. 20% off? Yeah, at the farm. Over there? All right, let's, and we should give props, I want to give props to, to Woody, because Woody, yep. um, oh, that's upside down, I'm going to go this way. Yeah, Chris Wooden, he's a local teacher at Landmark. He has helped, he has designed pretty much our logo and our concept with us. Jesus, huh? Yeah, he's a full time math teacher and he does this to help us out. It's amazing. Right there. He makes all those pigs for you? Uh, yes, he makes all the pigs. There you go. All right. Anything else you want to add? Um, definitely come down we're open until 2 a.m. So can't miss it. And once you once you start having our food, I'm telling you, you won't, you won't get a pulled pork or a burger anywhere else or a salad. Thanks, Noah. Yeah.